We weren't giving away like the cheap pre-rolls. We were giving away our really top shelf items. In what may have been the first ever state endorsed pot giveaway anywhere in the country, Spanaway's Natural Blessing Cannabis handed out about 30 joints Saturday to adults who got vaccinations in the parking lot. It was amazing. It was amazing. Owner Tamara Berkeley had been trying to organize a COVID vaccine clinic on her property weeks before the state approved its campaign called Joints for Jabs. We're just trying to help us all get to that 70% mark. We're a cannabis store. We don't do vaccinations on a regular basis. Maggie Doyle manages Olympia's Green Lady, one of many retailers hesitant to offer any shots for pot, at least for the time being. She says the state's endorsement for the giveaways did not come with enough guidelines on how the cannabis stores are supposed to give out the vaccines. We did speak to our insurance carriers as well, and they said because of all of these open-ended questions and there's no here's how you accomplish this, that we would not be covered. When it first came to mind, red tape and all that was, was never a thought. Back in Spanaway late Friday, Tamara Berkeley got word the state's Department of Health would pay for the private medical staff she hired to give out the vaccines. She's not worried about any repercussions because she feels she's helping reach a population the state hasn't been able to. So I think it's the relationship. You know, we see some of these folks every day. They get to know us, we get to know them. They just, they feel comfortable here. Initially, after this was announced, a number of pot shops came out saying we just don't have the space to have any kind of vaccine clinic. But now the Liquor Cannabis Board has said that places can use their parking lots for drive through clinics or just for, for extra seating. And, and one pot shop owner told the state that could be a game changer. We'll see if anyone follows that Spanaway owner's lead. Live in Olympia, Drew Mickelson, King 5 News.